Welcome to Intermediate Level English Language Arts. Our topic for writing class would be writing a news article. Okay, for writing a news article, okay, a news article, by the way, class, is um, a write-up or written, uh, something that's written that answers the five W's, what, who, when, where, or why, and one H, how. Now, you might see that there is a an asterisk for the why and the how, okay? The reason why there are asterisks over there is because um, these are not always answering the news articles and they're not always being answered by news articles, no, okay? So usually in a lot of news articles, you would have um, what, who, when, and where, okay? Why isn't always answered, how is also not always answered, okay? Especially certain news, um, not all the time can people identify the, the why and the how immediately, all right? Now, um, it, for, it informs the reader of what's happening around them. That's what news articles are for. It tells what's happening around the readers, right? Okay, and the information in news articles, they're arranged from the most important to the least important. So sometimes certain things that happen, right, happen, right, they... Um, the most important thing there is the what, so they start with the what, followed by the who, the when, the where, or sometimes the who is more important, right? And then followed by the what, the when, and the where, okay? So all of these things are different ways of um, identifying what a news article is, okay? Now, at this time, I want you guys to prepare because you're going to be writing a news article, okay? So for writing a news article, when you want to apply the writing process in the news article, uh, you could apply the writing process in the news article. Okay, what's the writing process again? That's the pre-write, the draft, the revise, the edit, and the publish. The pre-write. When you want to pre-write, the pre-write for this is, oh, by the way, for those of you who are going to be asking servants, are you going to be writing these down in the uh, notebooks or the papers later on? No. You will only be doing the publish on your notebooks. Everything else you would be doing either in a separate notebook or in a different sheet of paper. It's up to you, but you won't have to submit them. All right? Okay. So number one, pre-write. Choose your news article. It has to be a recent news article. It has to be a new recent news. Okay? So something that happened last week or this month or last month, right? That's fine. Where will you find those? You could either listen or read or watch them online in the radio or read them in the newspaper or at the local or international TV or news programs, right? Look for news, okay? Then after when you find a certain news, right, I want you guys to draft it. Now, I want you to draw an inverted pyramid, inverted triangle, right? And I want you guys to put on the very top most, the most important things, details, okay? Then followed by the least and the least and the least and the, 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 the lesser ones, right, are going to be in the middle. And the least important uh, detail will be at the very bottom, okay? That's going to be in your draft. Think of already an attention-grabbing title. So the title has to be something, you know, going to be grabbing the attention. Example, um, a cure for COVID-19 has already been found. Okay, example, right? Or... Davao City has reported the certain number of cases of COVID-19. Okay, whatever the news that you're going to be finding, okay, make sure that you think of a, an attention-grabbing title. Next, revise. When you're going to be doing your revise, make sure you reread your work. Read it again. And make sure that you look at the questions properly. You, have, you, you try to look at what's there in your books. Okay, there's a revising checklist. Okay, um, there are five things there that you have to look at, right? Did you put the most important information in the first paragraph? Did you make an appropriate attention grabber title for your article? Did you, oh, that's did not do it. Sorry, let me just fix that one. Hold on. Oh, there we go. Okay, so did you provide enough information for in your news article? Are the information correct and necessary? Are they? Did you check the subject and verb agreement of your sentences? Did you? Okay, all of these things, you have to make sure that you look at it and then when you're going to be doing a revise. And then, after that, when you do your revise, you follow it up with your edits. Now, for your edits, check for errors in spelling. Check for punctuation marks. Double check that. Your capitalizations. Did you 
follow the rules for capitalizations, right? Did you capitalize the first letter of your uh, paragraphs or of your sentences? Did you put proper intention? What are the intentions again? These are the spaces. The lines are the, the spaces before the very first line of your paragraph, the very first sentence of your paragraph. Make sure that you put your intentions, okay? When you've done work and you're done with that, I want you to publish your work. Now, when you publish your work, it would look like this, okay? Instruction for your published work, okay? Write a news article about any recent news. You write at least one to three paragraphs. It depends on you guys. It could just be one paragraph. It could be two or three. The maximum is three, okay? With at least minimum of five sentences per paragraph, okay? Give it a title and then label it news article and skip one space. Now, you can see in your screen over here, um, what would it look like, okay? Now, for this one, um, guys, this is going to be what it look like. What it would look like if you're going to be submitting it on a paper. But for the first week and the second week, you guys are going to be doing it in your notebooks. So, um, in your notebooks, you don't have to put the name and grade level section. No need. No need. Just put there the one in the middle, on the top, right? The news article, write that there. That's the label, followed by the date, and then write Ella at the side, at the top right. On the very first line, write your title of the news report and then skip one line and then the first paragraph. Then skip the next line, continue the paragraph, right?